Got to get to the 35. Lock steps in. Lost it deep down the field. It's underthrown. And it's intercepted by Fred Warner. And he flips it up there. And now there's a penalty flag at the end of the play. It's Greenlaw who has it. Greenlaw still on his feet. Hat flies from an official. The Green sideline in San Francisco is going bananas, telling them to get down. <laughs> I think DK Metcalf. I think DK Metcalf was in the middle of that. And got a lot going on here. Pete Carroll's on the field trying to separate. So, and that tells you everything you need to know, which is they're self-imposed things that happen to them not to close out a game because you can't dominate everyone and be up by He just has a hard time controlling his emotions when the game doesn't go his way. And here's another example. Pete Carroll's had a lot of sit-downs with him over the years about this exact thing. Data, this is a great right back for the next Chiefs snap in the red zone after we show you this. That was the body slam of DK Metcalf, and Fred Warner hits back at him. Then Metcalf comes, grabs his helmet. They're face to face. That's what precipitated the little mini brawl. And well, they sorted out the brawl, and DK Metcalf was ejected for the Seattle Seahawks. Diamador Lenore, one of the defensive backs who was on the field during that play, was also ejected. You had uh, not not.